What is up guys? Welcome back to another trailer reaction review. Today, we're going to be checking out the Call of Duty Modern Warfare official reveal trailer. The trailer is a minute 52 seconds standard time for a trailer, which is actually pretty refreshing after coming through yesterday's 10 minute long Death Stranding trailer, which was great by the way. I have a card just in case you want to check it. Um, I'm gonna keep these rolling. I'm, I'm liking the vibe that I have now, especially leading up to E3 where I'm gonna have to do a ton of these. So I'm just keep the ball rolling. Today is gonna be about Call of Duty, today's trailer reaction review. So let's jump right in. I'm excited. I'm a Call of Duty head, buy them every year. Love that this year they're bringing back the story I heard and they have a whole bunch of stuff that's supposed to be, you know, for Vietnam. I'm questioning about some of the stuff I'm hearing. Let's check out the trailer and then see if this stuff is true if it's if it's if it's gonna be any good because you know a lot of times the trailers could, could let us know out the gate blackouts 4 i mean that reveal kind of let me know that it was gonna be a good game multiplayer wise but it didn't stick with me like after the first couple of after the first like couple of months i was i was i was out i was back in fortnite so and i think that's the problem call of duty has to deal with they have to overcome and give us something to chew on that's gonna keep us coming back because we live in a post Fortnite world where, yeah, they're different games, but if we gotta be grinding Fortnite, we ain't gonna be grinding Call of Duty. You know what I'm saying? So let's jump right in. Let's check out this trailer, which is supposed to be good. Actual in game footage. The rules have changed. There's a fine line between right. I'm wrong. And Is somewhere that... in the shadows, they send us in to find it. Watch your six actual targeting. Yeah, the that's on. You have execute authority. You guys think? Over six. Going dark. This is hella young. Call of Duty Modern Warfare, October 25th. Looks clean, looks super clean. Um, hmm. The trailer looks clean. This is a great way to to show Call of Duty. I mean, it's Call of Duty, right? So it's like, what, what are you gonna show? I mean, what they show was lit. There was, there was lit stuff in this trailer, especially in a Call of Duty world where you want it to be cinematically entertaining and look the part. You know, Call of Duty is the best selling game literally every year outside of, you know, the Rockstar games and stuff like that. And I, I think Call of Duty really beats them out when it comes to um, game sales. And that could be wrong. Let me know in the comment section below. But... That is truly an amazing feat, and to be hitting it out the park consistently and consistently and consistently. Now, mind you, I'm not saying all of their games are 100% the greatest games of all time, and just because they are selling incredibly well means that they are the best games of that year. No, but what I'm saying is that when they do drop and they do drop stuff like this that looks that's gonna have a great single player campaign, people love to play through them because they are entertaining. They do feel like these, you know, fast and furious 
these summer blockbuster movies, you know, that gets people out to see them. And that's what they know how to do correctly. And it was very hurtful when we seen that Black Top 4 missed out on the opportunity to continue the story. And they kind of did, but they kind of did it in a trash way, in my opinion. And this is looking like it's picking up and like, yo, you guys missed out on a single player last year. This is what we're focusing on. It didn't show from what I've seen here. It didn't look like they show any multiplayer through this. This looked like a straight single player focused trailer. And I could be wrong, but it does look super clean. Mind you, did it hit hard? Did it get me, you know, my heart pumping? Do I even care about what's going on? It seems like just another war, another reason for them to fight. The trailer didn't hook me itself. While what I'm hearing from the game, it actually is, and it's kind of sad that this trailer kind of fell flat due to the fact that we may be seeing more of future blowout at E3 or whenever they do the huge blowout for the game where they, you know, how they have their own Call of Duty event and stuff like that. It's kind of sad that they didn't do that with this release of this trailer, especially after hyping it up. It's like they hyped it up and dropped this trailer and this trailer seems so minuscule compared to the buzz around Call of Duty and the Modern Warfare name. I'm gonna have to give this trailer a three out of five. Now, mind you, it is high because it is good. It is a well-produced, a great trailer, a great representation for Call of Duty Modern Warfare, but it didn't give me any story beats that makes me want to care about what's going on as well. There was no surprises. Everything was expected and it did what it came to do. Mind you, that's what Activision does best. That's what Call of Duty does best. It just does what it does. <laughs> It, it just comes what it comes to do. It's kind of like a sports title at this point where you know how Madden is going to play. Yeah, they add features. They add different stuff every year, but it's going to play the same. And that's exactly what this looks like. It looks like it's going to be a brand new story for us to deep into brand new missions, brand new probably guns and stuff like that. But it's going to play the same. And that doesn't get me too excited, but it gets me excited enough to, again, I'm probably one of those people that buy this day one play day one and probably play for a couple of months by just looking at this trailer i'm definitely going to play through the story because of the just the the visuals alone have me hooked in as well as a couple of the scenes of you know them entering the what it looks like to be a house with the cam over the head i hope they have that in game as something you can like play through but besides that there was nothing that like had me like yes i want to play it oh my god they're bringing this guy back because you know they, they look like they're bringing some of the characters back but it's like i can't even name son so it's like you know it's like i don't have that huge connection even though i played through all the modern warfare one two and three and completed the story to the point that i was trying to get all the achievements and stuff back on the xbox 360 but it just I'm, I'm struggling to see what everyone is seeing with this title and maybe that's just because of all the buzz of what they showed at Judges Week compared to what they're showing us, the public, at this trailer. So I'm gonna end this here. Let me know your thoughts of this trailer in the comment section below. If there is another trailer for Cold and Modern Warfare, I will be doing another trailer reaction review for it. This again, it kind of missed the bar for me. Even though I did grade it a good trailer because it is, kind of missed the bar for me. Um, it's definitely a buy. But it's just like, ah, come on, Call of Duty, you guys are great. Show the great shit. Like, show us, make me want to be like, yo, that shit is fun. You know, I know they, they have it in them, and I feel like they're probably just saving that. But it just feels like it was missing something in this trailer. If they show that in the next trailer, I'll probably give it a perfect score. Let me know your, what your thoughts on this trailer in the comment section below. Peace. I love you guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next trailer reaction review like always guys i'm daddy gamer fred on instagram and twitter and you guys can bring the conversation there i'm the american gamer in switzerland right here on youtube and yes i'm gonna be doing a ton of videos just like this one so if you enjoy please hit that subscribe button also hit the like button it does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time i drop a video peace i'm gonna see you guys on the next one